Hi, I'm David Kaner for ExpertVillage.com. I'm talking about chin rests. Here's a chin rest, a violin chin rest. This is the area, the chin cup. And these are turnbuckles, basically. Um, you turn them one direction and this clamp loosens. Turn in the other direction and the clamp tightens. And there are a number of different styles of chin rests. Some of them clamp on the um, base side of the violin. Um, others, like this one, which I prefer, clamp over the tailpiece. If you can imagine the tailpiece being in place here. In fact, I can put it in place. If the tailpiece is in place, then the chin rest clamps over it. And then there are some special little tools you can use for tightening the chin rest, or you can make a tool out of a, out of a paper clip or a little nail. It's important to try to not scratch the ribs when you're tightening the little turnbuckles. But then the fiddle, then the chin rest clamps to the fiddle, hopefully tight enough to remain stable, but not so tight as to do any damage to the instrument itself. And it becomes a very comfortable support. One hopes it becomes a very comfortable support. The reason why I, pref one reason why I prefer the over the chin rest, uh, the over the um, uh, tailpiece chin rest, is that here we have the end block of the fiddle, which is a piece of spruce, carved spruce, and the grain runs vertically. This means that it's relatively strong. It's relatively um, resistant to the down pressure, the squeezing or clamping pressure of a chin rest. And I feel that is safer than having a chin rest clamp over on the side of the instrument where, where well, the lining appears to make the rib a little thinner, a little thicker, but in fact, the rib is actually a very thin piece of maple. Um, most of today's fiddle players, and most, I think most violin players, are accustomed to using chin rests, and the idea of a chin rest is to, is to make a comfortable orientation of the violin between the chin, the shoulder, or shoulder blade, and and the hand, and when combined, when a, when a comfortable chin rest is combined with a comfortable shoulder rest, holding the violin securely can be very comfortable and involve very little effort. 